Taylor Swift may have said so long, London, but now she's back in town, the pop star, 34, ventured to the Notting Hill neighborhood on Tuesday, June 11, with her pals for dinner at Casa Cruz, per photos obtained by the Daily Mail. She was joined by Kate Moss, Stella McCartney, Andrew Scott, Phoebe Waller-Bridge, Cara Delevingne and Lena Dunham, Swift stepped out in a black corset top with black pants featuring a matching design on the bottom. She paired the look with a grey coat and a clock choker necklace, which she previously debuted at the Grammys in February as a reference to her tenth studio album, Midnights. Swift topped off the outfit with red heels and a matching red lip, the night out comes amid Swift's break in her era's tour. She's set to perform at Liverpool's Anfield Stadium on Thursday, June 13. Fleabag co stars Waller Bridge, 38, and Scott, 47, were seen departing together from the gathering, which came months after Scott made headlines for his group chat with Paul Mescal and Swift's ex Joe Alwyn titled Tortured Man Club, following Swift's announcement of her 11th studio album in February. A video resurfaced of Alwyn, 33 revealing their group chat name during a 2022 interview for Variety's Actors on Actors series. The clip led fans to believe that the Tortured Poets Department's title was inspired by the chat given the use of the word tortured in both. In May, Scott revealed the reasoning behind their chat's name. Let me tell you what that is. Scott told Variety at the time. So they were about to play these tortured characters, and I had played a tortured character in Fleabag. It wasn't about our own characteristics. At the time, Alwyn and Mescal, 28, were both slated to appear in adaptations of Sally Rooney's novels. Mescal portrayed Connell in 2020's Normal People, while Alwyn starred as Nick Conway in Hulu's adaptation of Rooney's Conversation with Friends. Thank you, you have successfully subscribed. Subscribe to newsletter, subscribe by signing up. I agree to the terms and privacy policy and to receive emails from what's the gossip deal of the day snag 20 off this cool and cozy blanket for summer. View deal check our latest news in Google News follow us check our latest news in Apple News follow us you have successfully subscribed. By signing up, I agree to the terms and privacy policy and to receive emails from what's the gossip check our latest news in Google News check our latest news in Apple News Swift's TTPD was released in April and seemingly featured several tracks inspired by her and Alwyn's six-year relationship. Scott, for his part, gushed that he's a fan of the album and noted that his favorite track is The Smallest Man Who Ever Lived, Taylor's new album is sensational. I texted her yesterday to say how amazing it is, Scott told Variety. I think she is just a force of nature, just an extraordinary human, and this album is really, really amazing.